hey what's going on everybody hope you all are doing good just a quick video of an iron man perk that completely takes him to another level now iron man is already pretty much busted in this game and it's kind of broken especially during the raid but this one piece and one perk in particular just makes him that much better and the perk that i'm talking about is rampant assistance and this perk comes on different slots depending on the character but for iron man you want this in slot one now the reason why it's so important is because it's going to give you 200 percent reward recharge rate while you're overcharged now you may look at it and say well it says 2.1 percent and it gives you 200 percent is it broken actually it's not a bug or anything it's working as intended right now but do expect some type of nerf uh with this piece in the future i'm not saying that they will nerf it but i wouldn't be surprised but at the same time they still have a nerf damage buff and tachyon surge which is one piece that gives a 90 percent damage increase just from one piece so if you want to talk about something that's busted that's way more busted than this but anyway this piece is really good especially combined with this slot four piece the centurion quantum reactor where you get a 150 percent increase critical attack damage while overcharged and you get an extra arc overload charge now this piece can be farmed from the priority missions so as long as you're overcharged you have a 150 percent increase critical attack damage and it's easier to stay overcharged because you have the extra arc overload which makes you overcharged and you have the 200 percent heroic recharge rate on slot one now the video that you're currently watching is from dirt diggler he was in the team who had the world record for the marvel's avengers elite raid and this is a clip from the world record as well and one thing that you might see him doing from time to time is after he activates his support heroic he'll use his assault heroic and he'll use his unibeam now the reason why he does this and why he'll just tap on the unibeam without using all of its energy is because every time you use the unibeam it's going to increase your support heroic by 10 seconds so if you pop your support heroic and become overcharged and it's lasting for 14 seconds initially once you press r1 or whatever console you're on uh, to activate your assault heroic it's going to get boosted by 10 more seconds now having it set up like this will allow you to never have to pick up an orb and stay overcharged for the entire mission now this piece with the 2.2 percent aurora recharge rate which is 200 is a random drop so it could be pretty difficult to get and it could be pretty easy to get so just check the vendors play the snowy tundra vault a few times even play some olt missions uh, and after a few hours you should have this drop but yeah that's it everybody just wanted to leave you with this short video on an Iron Man perk that you may want to pick up before Cloning Labs comes out. And before we leave, while we're on the topic, Dirk actually competes in weekly elite raid races. So be sure to subscribe to his channel and to his Twitch channel as well. Sometimes we'll have races up to eight teams racing at once. Um, all of it's being streamed on Twitch. It's such a good event to see just seeing a lot of different people competing against each other, uh, just learning different tactics and different things from each other. And it's just a very good environment just to be in. So be sure to subscribe to his channel, uh, his YouTube and Twitch, to check out some more Elite Raid races. And those races happen on every Friday night at 11 p.m. Eastern Time. Uh, if you did enjoy this video, make sure you like and subscribe. Thank you. Have a great day.